Okay, we're doing a large spring modification on a set of 308 cast iron heads here. And uh, what happens is the 308 engine runs a small diameter spring seat there. With that style spring, so that's sort of limited in what can be used for. Sort of 286 crane hydraulic, that's about its extent. 120 pound on the seat. So this particular job we're running a uh, mechanical flat tappet crane cam and we have to go up to this style spring which is a large diameter double spring so this multi cut style cutter will machine the boss for a teflon seal and it'll machine the spring landing for the bigger seat uh, bigger springs all in one cut so there's a few various seals we can use this particular job we're going to run the Howard Teflon fit on style seal which fits onto the top of the guide, it knocks onto the top of the guide, bit of a press fit that expands over and holds itself onto the guide. Not a bad seal, but fairly durable for a streetish style engine. Or can use a crane Teflon seal, which is a nice seal as well. A little bit harsher on the guide, will tend to wipe a lot more oil off. Really good for a racing application. Or we can use the crane steelback Viton style rubber fit on seals, which are a good seal as well. That's another good seal for a street engine. For a positive style valve stem seal. So we're going to go ahead and machine this spring seat. We go fairly easy on the cut because it's cutting about four or five different diameters as the cutter goes down into the job. reduce the length of the guide and it'll machine the boss for the fit of the seal it'll almost it already machine the inner landing for the inner spring or the larger double inner spring then it'll start to machine the outer landing for the outer double spring go down to the base, we just clean up the base so that it's a nice clean base. This particular job's not having the spring seats lowered at all. That's it, that's how you machine for a larger spring and Teflon seal.